Well, well, look what we have here. The new TXP5 from Percussion Air. All right, so let's take a look. Let's open it up. Compact design. This is great. Clean packaging, ready to go with a new design for a pole clamp. Huh. It's a little vice system. Yeah. Huh. 50 PSI source, high frequency ventilator. <laughs> all right this is what it'll look like when it's all connected portable transport high frequency percussive ventilation not to be confused with the high frequency jet ventilator or high frequency oscillator this is the one and only high frequency percussive ventilator by percussion air being distributed by Pulmonair. We got our hands on a demo unit as they start to roll out throughout the country to help with the COVID-19 pandemic. And here we have a very simplistic approach at ventilating the lungs with lower mean airway pressures compared to conventional ventilation. We have your amplitude and your frequency. So quick reminder, the frequency is going to be displayed as the percussions per minute, while the amplitude is going to show as the map along with the peak pressure. As I turn up the frequency, you're going to notice that I'm going to be achieving a very high percussions per minute. Uh, I can achieve upwards of 700 if I max it out, along with increasing my amplitude you see that the lung does not have much time to collapse between percussions which is going to really enhance the recruitment aspect along with uh, improved oxygenation on your patients. Uh, the Vasotron itself is still reminiscent of the open system design and with our COVID patients we're going to want to have viral bacterial filters on inspiratory and expiratory limbs uh, you know just to enhance uh, safety within a medical setting. Uh, but the open system design is key to being able to uh, effectively ventilate a diseased lung while being a safe and effective strategy. Thanks again, and uh, please come back for future videos on everything IPV.